We're outside the Parks Canada office here on the shores of Little Lake and I'm joined by Richard Scott, a heritage planner with the Trent Severn Waterway and we were witnessing folks out in canoes earlier. You were and uh, we had a morning commute and we intend to have an afternoon commute as well, weather permitting. And uh, this is the first time we've done that but we've had tremendous participation of Parks Canada employees here. Uh, in the Shifting Gears program and uh, we think this will happen every year now, it's very popular. How long have you guys been participating in Shifting Gears? This is our third year now and uh, our first year we had very humble beginnings mm -hmm. and uh, not a high level participation and last year things just mushroomed and we took our category and this year we're way on top of our pack as well for uh, 25 to 250 employee companies so mm -hmm. uh, it looked as if we may take it again this year. Why is this something that you feel you should participate in? Uh, it's something, I, Parks Canada is, uh, it's a uh, environmental organization, mm -hmm. uh, it's celebrating its uh, 100th anniversary uh, this year and uh, we just feel that it uh, helps us make a statement about what we believe in and uh, we have uh, more than half the number of employees working here are participating. What are some of the other ways uh, you get to work? in shifting gears? Uh, we have a whole range of uh, ways besides canoeing, uh, cycling, people are walking, we've had a, a person rollerblade, mm -hmm. uh, we have a lot of carpooling as well and uh, so we're using just about every category that shifting gears allows us to use except canoeing which we may ask to be added for <laughs> next year. Exactly, good idea. Happy 100th birthday Parks Canada from the Trans Severn Waterway. And you mentioned earlier um, Parks Canada celebrating its uh, fairly significant anniversary. It's 100 years of Parks Canada and uh, it's amazing. We have a network of 42 national parks, 167 national historic sites and four national marine conservation areas. So there are celebrations across Canada uh, all this summer. We have an action-packed summer full of really interesting events for Canadians. All right, sounds good. And we also have a fairly significant historic site right here in town that has to do with the waterway. We do, and uh, the Trent Severn Waterway right here, and of course the, I guess the, uh, the, the shining star, the Peterborough Lift Lock, and more than 100 years old, and uh, it never fails to uh, amaze people that come to see this uh, piece of machinery in operation. Sounds like something we should all get out and check out this summer. Absolutely, Peterborough, uh, it's in our backyard, so uh, we should check it out. Exactly. Well, thanks for talking to me today, Richard. Thank you, Matt. And we'll see you again next week on The Green Update. The Green Update is brought to you by the City of Peterborough. Make the most of summer by walking to work and enjoying being outdoors. If you have any questions about today's episode of The Green Update, call Peterborough Green Up at 745-3238.